Okay, so you can see I have the gunnels drawn up and laid out, um, and the angle is cut on the bottom, uh, which is the bottom because the rib mortises are there. So that's confirmation for myself. And uh, the sturdiest thing I have to do anything with is my uh, <laughs> my deck beam, not that kind of deck beam, but you know, for my deck. Uh, and I figured out I could clamp this underneath here. Um, and this is, you know, as sturdy as any, anything gets. So that was me wiggling it. You couldn't see it. Um, so I have it, uh, clamped in three places with, you know, my biggest, uh, clamps. And then I have, um, my little pre-drilled, um, this is the piece that I got in my kit uh, with the um, the deck beam holes drilled in it. And then I drilled these quarter inch holes here uh, to put on. So what I can do is just position it like this uh, so you can see it. Just have it clamped to a little piece of cedar and you can see it's pretty well lined up. I need to do a test. I'm going to do a test down at the end before, you know, not at, so if it's, so I can position it right. I'm going to do it outside of one of the actual areas uh, for the, for the rib mortise. And uh, then I'll know that's it. So I'll make adjustments if I need to, and then I'll start cutting or drilling, drilling the holes out. Okay, so you can see that um, I ended up, it's, this is my first one, and it's slightly off center, um, so I'll readjust again for the next one, but I, um, and it's longer than my line spacing, which I, was an inch, but um, in any case, I'm using the, uh, I got some deck beams from Brian uh, that, uh, um, you know, I ordered and they are larger than this so I'm going to not cut the I just I had to make it larger because I tested the deck beam in it and you can see that uh, you know it needed that extra space pretty much um, yeah so hopefully I'll make it easier to put it in place make sure I have enough room for it um, and both ends of this one see it's well, you can't see. There you go. See, there's more space there on that one. I got another one. So, yeah, so the one end of the one is a little longer than the others looks like, but I don't think it matters. I think as long as it gets in there and there's enough wood around it to hold it in place, that's what we're looking for. Uh, yeah, you can see this end is definitely thinner than the other, the one end of the other one. So, um, so I'm glad I brought a couple out to check. So, in any case, so the width is pretty good. Um, uh, you know, the quarter inch part of it, and then um, looks like the length is going to vary. So I'll make sure it'll they'll these two will fit in each one as I go, and adjust the length accordingly. But it looks like I need to be at least outside of the black my black lines, whatever that measurement is. Which I think it's more important that the I'm fitting it to the uh, to the ribs as opposed to just some fixed measurement because that's the ribs I have and I'm not making any. So, all right, I'm going to cut the rest of these and I'll go on. 
So I don't know if you can see it here, but the consistently I'm let's see one two three four. This is my this is number seven of and uh, of the mortises, and you can see that it's they're slightly angled in this in this direction, kind of you know across the piece a little bit, and they're all like that. And I don't know, well, except for one, but most of them, most of them are angled with the, the this end a little out here and that end a little bit that way. And I don't know why. And it's really, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but I can see it really clearly when I put the, the rib in. It makes it, uh, and of course, it's all distorted now, but, um, you know, it, it really, you can really see the angle on it. So I don't know why that's doing that. It's I'm using the same hole and the same bracket um, every time, you know, as it's going through. So I don't know why it would shift just in that thing. But anyway, but that seems to be what's happening with it. I don't, again, I don't think it matters too much. Uh, it'll just twist the thing a little bit, and we'll see how the if the other side twists the opposite way, and I make a problem or something. Or, anyway, but the ribs should be pretty good. All right, just a note, something I noticed.